It's the Full Force News Burst Extra, brought to you by GeneralsJoesReborn.com, with me, Christopher McLeod, aka Diagnostic80. An image of the G.I. Joe classified Arctic bat has emerged online. An image of the brand new classified Arctic bat has dropped online courtesy of T1Toy on Instagram. Now, we first learned about the figure during the G.I. Joe livestream back in March when it appeared in the background of a Snowjob product shot. Since then, Emily officially confirmed on this very show that the Arctic bat was indeed legitimate and was a purposeful tease by the marketing team. This new image shows the front of the box with the figure render in action on a snowy backdrop, and there are some very cool things to note about both the figure and the packaging. Firstly, there looks to be some new tooling with a brand new head very reminiscent of the blue ninjas from the IDW A Real American Hero comics. I love this additional head and think it looks super intimidating. I wonder if this could also be a precursor to the blue ninjas as well. Knowing the team I would imagine they are thinking forward with this so expect that at some point in the future. We also have a very gnarly looking chainsaw attachment which is absolutely hardcore as f I wonder if we will see a retooled version of it with the so far name only revealed buzzer very soon. Another possible thing to ponder there. The figure also comes with a sniper rifle the standard head in the white and blue deco, a standard left hand for symmetry purposes, pistol, backpack and three different chest plates, maybe. The white with Cobra logo, a damaged version and a slightly different dark grey version that looks like it goes with the new secondary pieces on the shoulders and upper legs. It could however be a second backpack but it's hard to tell on the image. The white, grey, blue and silver deco looks so good and is so much better than just basic white but I would have enjoyed to see a touch of camo like the modern 4 inch figure had. The packaging is in that brand new style which will be changing again next spring to accommodate the return to plastic windows. The box art features some interesting additions including a military cargo plane flying away in the distance and what appears to be a Cobra Rattler on fire in the background. Looks like the bat was flying it and escaped unscathed to continue its mission to get Cobra Commander a fresh Christmas tree. The figure looks even better than the images we saw back in March and I cannot wait to see video reviews and more images of this beauty in the next few weeks. They've clearly gone the extra mile with this version of the bat which so far has been extremely well received by fans. I was hoping for some additional extras with this one and they have not disappointed us at all. It's very likely more images and videos will follow so we will update with any new developments over the next few weeks. Anyway, what do you guys think? Happy with the look of the figure? Were you expecting something else? What other types of bats would you like to see in the line? Let me know in the comments below. Okay team, lots more content to come this week so keep it locked, stay fresh cheese bags and as always, full force. That's it for this instalment of the Full Force News Burst Extra. Thank you for watching, make sure to like, comment and subscribe. See you next time and as always, Full Force. Make sure you get involved with the discussion by liking, sharing and commenting on these videos and as always you can keep up with the show after listening by following on Twitter at The Full Force, liking the Facebook page facebook.com forward slash The Full Force and if you would like to contact the show you can message us on either of those platforms with feedback and questions. We also have a Patreon page so if you want to show your support for the show, see your name up in lights on these videos or enjoy exclusive bonus content then check out patreon.com forward slash the full force podcast or click on the link on any of the posts this podcast appears in full force